Street Louis de Montfort Secret of the Rosary Seventh Rose. Ever since blessed Alain de la Roche re-established this devotion, the Rosary, which means crown of roses. That is to say that every time people say the Rosary devoutly they place on the heads of Jesus and Mary 153 white roses and 16 red roses. Being heavenly flowers, these roses will never fade or lose their beauty. Our Lady has approved and confirmed this name of the Rosary. She has revealed to several people that each time they say a Hail Mary they are giving her a beautiful rose, and that each complete rosary makes her a crown of roses. The Jesuit brother, Alphonsus Rodriguez, used to say his rosary with such fervor that he often saw a red rose come out of his mouth at each Our Father, and a white rose at each Hail Mary, both equal in beauty and differing only in color. The Chronicles of St. Francis tell of a young friar who had the praiseworthy habit of saying this crown of Our Lady every day before dinner. One day, for some reason or other, he did not manage to say it. The refectory bell had already been rung when he asked the superior to allow him to say it before coming to the table, and, having obtained permission, he withdrew to his cell to pray. After he had been gone a long time, the superior sent another friar to fetch him, and he found him in his room bathed in a heavenly light in the presence of Our Lady and two angels. Beautiful roses kept issuing from his mouth at each Hail Mary, and the two angels were taking them one by one and placing them on Our Lady's head, while she smilingly accepted them. Finally, two other friars who had been sent to find out what had happened to the first two saw the same scene, and Our Lady did not leave until the whole rosary had been said. So the complete rosary is a large crown of roses and each chaplet of five decades is a little wreath of flowers or a little crown of heavenly roses which we place on the heads of Jesus and Mary. The rose is the queen of flowers, and so the rosary is the rose of devotions and the most important one.